YouTube, what is up? So basically my headset broke after three years. I'm not mad about it because it lasted that long. So basically this video is not going to be riding. I'm just going to be at home giving you my top five best scooter life hacks. Let's get into it. Alright, so the first life hack is something I wish I knew a long time ago because it would have saved me so much time. Is if you guys ride plastic bar ends, ODI bar ends, everybody used to ride them. But every once in a while, this would happen. You would hit it against the ground and then the outer ring comes right off. Then you're stuck with this stuck inside your bars. F that, okay? This is the most annoying thing ever. But lucky for you, I'm gonna save your time and show you this quick life hack. All you need is a corkscrew. So basically I have this like really advanced one. You don't need that. You can just get like a normal corkscrew. All right, so basically what you're gonna do is screw this end of the corkscrew straight into the bar end as much as you can so it has a lot to grab onto. So you just put it in and start screwing. All right guys, so this corkscrew is all the way in as much as it's gonna go. Let's just pull these levers and see if the bar end comes out. Look at that. Just like that, bar end came right out. That was literally so easy. Back then you used to have to either hit the bar end all the way back into the bar and just ignore it, or you'd have to get like pliers and just work hours and hours trying to get it out. So boom, just like that, bar end is out. On to the next life hack. Alright guys, so the second life hack I'm going to be showing you guys is something that's not only going to be saving you time, but it's going to be saving you so much money in the long run. So basically all this life hack is, is you know when your wheels, let me focus this, is you know when your wheels start to, to peel just like this, like it's hard to show on camera, but your wheels just start peeling, you know? and. And there's really no point at all in buying a new wheel because of this. I know a lot of people, like some of my friends, would just buy a completely new wheel and you're wasting money right now. All you have to do, super glue. This stuff right here is literally gonna save your life. Promise you. All you have to do is find the spot that's cracking and it's really straightforward. All you have to do, take your super glue and fill the crack as much as you can and then press down, wait for it to dry. Alright guys, so as you can see, I filled the crack just like that, and what you're going to do is take something like the cap right here, and just press up against it. You just want to hold it until it dries, and then soon enough, your wheel will be perfectly fine, and you can just ride it like nothing happened. Alright guys, so the next life hack I'm going to be showing you is something I know you guys can relate to a lot, is you know when you're taking your grips off, and all of a sudden your grip becomes inside out? Yeah, well, that used to happen to me all the time, and I have one solution to that, and I'm gonna show you that right now. All right, so literally all you have to do is take your inside out grip and just slide it onto your bars like you would normally for a normal scooter grip. All right, so here's where the life hack comes in. See how I'm already starting to go past it? You wanna go even further. Keep going, just go all the way. All right, see how there's about an inch or so left of the bar, that's good. Now you wanna just roll your grips back, just like you did when you made them inside out. So, roll them. And boom, this is exactly what you want. You just wanna pull this end, and then boom, there you go. Your grip is perfectly good. Scooter life hack number four is probably my favorite, so I'm gonna take you off this tree and go show you it. Alright guys, so let's say you're at home taking apart your scooter and trying to make everything nice and tight, but your clamp won't come off, and that is literally the most annoying thing ever. But lucky for you, I have a super easy solution to this, and it's also really cool how it works, so let's get right into it. Alright guys, so literally the only thing you guys are going to need is an Allen key and a quarter, anything you need. It's called the penny trick, but I like using a nickel because I think it's like thicker, so find any coin. What you're going to want to do is take your allen key and start unscrewing the first bolt. Then once that's out, all you want to do is take the bolt, put it on the other side, and start screwing it in. Once it gets to this point, all you want to do is put your coin 
right in between the bolt and the other side of the clamp and start tightening it. As you tighten it, you'll see that the clamp spreads open and the more you tighten it, the looser your clamp should get on your bar. So just tight, keep tightening until you can pull your clamp right off. All right, so this next life hack is for anybody that rides a mag gear or plans on riding a mag gear. So after riding a mag gear, you'll soon realize that the back spacers aren't like any other back spacers. They're smaller than a normal one. So if you lose one, you're basically screwed. Unless you watch this video and you know this life hack. All right guys, so all you're gonna need for this fifth and final life hack is a bearing and a hammer. All right guys, so what you wanna do is grab your hammer and place your bearing so it's like standing up and all you wanna do is start hitting it until the bearing breaks basically. So you're probably gonna have to hit it pretty hard and it should take one or two tries. And what you're left with is a bunch of other pieces that you don't really need, but you do need this special little space right here. This is actually coincidentally the perfect size for a Mad Gear deck. All right guys, so that's gonna do it for this video. Uh, I really hope you guys enjoyed it. It was definitely a little bit different than my other videos, but I hope you guys still liked it. Leave a comment down below what else you guys wanna see and subscribe for more. Thank you guys so much for watching, bye.